Hi there, Leo, and welcome back to Star Lord is Tarot. This is your tarot forecast for the week of December 4th through to the 10th. I went ahead, shuffled cards, laid them all out. Let's see what's going on for Leo. First up, we have the Knight of Wands in the upright, followed then by the Ten of Cups upright. Next, we have Major Arcana, the Emperor in the upright. Followed then by the Ten of Pentacles upright. And lastly, the Two of Pentacles. All of your cards are in the upright position. Looks like a wild week for Leo. <laughs> your overall energy is Pajama Man after all. Knight of Wands in the upright position. I say Pajama Man because he looks like he's wearing jammies. In this deck anyway. Not in all the decks, but this one. <laughs> Knight of Wands in the upright position is a court card. Could be representing a person. If it's representing a person, this is fire energy. Aries, Leo, Sag, Sun, Moon, or Rising. Now, Wands usually bring in some kind of offer. It could be a quick offer because usually the Knight of Wands doesn't stick around too long to let you deliberate on things. You could be dealing with someone external to you who's coming towards you and making an offer. Now, this could be uh, make perfect sense to you if you perhaps have your home or your business or something up for sale. There could be an offer that comes in quickly out of the blue, just like Quicksilver. He tends to just pop in. Remember now, this is you also coming up in your own reading in the upright position, indicating you are on the right path, Leo, with any offer you would like to extend to someone else. Like say, for example, you want to purchase somebody's business or home or something like that. This could be you coming in with a quick offer. This can also uh, represent an offer of passion, fun, excitement, travel, because the wands are all about those things as well. So for some of you, perhaps you want to go in and sweep someone off their feet and perhaps make an offer to them, or perhaps someone is coming in to offer you something like this. This could represent a good friend of yours that perhaps comes in and uh, wants to, you know, take you out on some fun adventure could be want, wanting to offer you a business proposal or a business deal. Um, could be any of those. Now let us know in the comment section below because we want to hear from you. Right at the beginning of the week, you have the beautiful Ten of Cups in the upright position, indicating a beautiful emotional, peak emotional experience. Now this could be happening due to the fact that some of you could be going to an event where perhaps you're surrounded by family and friends or this could be happening in your own home. Sometimes this can be an indication of attending a party um, where all of our loved ones are at and we're just feeling the energy. It can be attending a wedding. It could be attending a birthday party or some other type of maybe holiday celebrations. But whatever it is, it's really beautiful experience could be something going on in the home that's just really really making you feel great on the emotional friends on the emotional uh, side it could be friends attending something at your home it could be bringing your new love into your home and having that all be well received by your loved ones next card up is the emperor in the upright position mars ruled energy it is uh, associated with the signs of both Aries and Scorpio could be significant for some but the Emperor is all about needing to keep control now this could be you yourself Leo feeling like you need to keep control over this overwhelming emotional experience could be somebody is coming home for the holidays or coming home to spend some time with you and your family and you're just overjoyed about it and this could be you saying hey hey not too much ruckus uh let's keep it down uh, let's keep control over the situation for others of you you could be dealing with somebody who is extremely controlling or trying to keep things under control remember the emperor is also known as a very it's a power card so it's definitely associated with somebody in a higher position it could be you're dealing with ceo of a company this could be the patriarch of your family such as your your father your grandfather or somebody like that who is coming on the scene in the upright position they mean to help they mean to assist so it is really good energy if this is somebody who you're dealing with in business this could represent someone in a position of power is uh, ready and willing and able to aid you and help you in some way really good energy when he's in the upright position except for if you or somebody else is being too controlling then it can be a little bit of a detriment 
Moving towards the weekend, we have the beautiful Ten of Pentacles in the upright position. Well, get ready for a, um, a nice surprise on the financial front. It could be that you or uh, someone in the family, you have both the Ten of Pentacles and the Ten of Cups in this reading. Like, how gorgeous is that? It's the peak experience. Tens represent the peak experience. So now this can represent anything from generational wealth uh, via uh, inheritance. It can be that you or someone else in the home or the family has um, just gotten some kind of bonus or perhaps a raise or landed a good job that could pay great dividends that could be uh, brought into the family for you know financial uplifting of everyone involved. <clears throat> And the last card you have is the Two of Pentacles in the upright position. Well, this is a really nice energy. Two of Pentacles upright represents harmony in the midst of change. Something could be changing out due to this new uh, wealthy situation in your home or with you yourself. Maybe some of you um, landed a nice bonus or landed extra money. And this could be you balancing your checkbook, trying to figure out what to do or where to place the funds, where it will be. Um, more lucrative if you place it maybe into some kind of savings or if you should invest it in something. It could just be trying to figure out what to do with your funds right now. Or uh, it could be that a big change up is happening as a result of this Ten of Pentacles. Could be that you landed a good job, but perhaps it's somewhere else and you need to now make a move. This does indicate that the move will go smoothly. Or it could be that you're buying somebody's business and now you have to juggle whatever you've got going on in your life in order to now incorporate this new thing. But it looks like all is going quite well. What an, a spectacular reading for you here this week, Leo. Glad to see it. Thank you so much for joining me. I hope you have a fabulous week. And I really hope that the reading helped you. If it did, please feel free to like, share, and subscribe. And I will see you again next week. Take care. Much love. Bye-bye for now.